Okay, this is a double stop uh, riff, and I just used a question and answer as an intro. So what we're doing, we're in the key of A, so what I'm doing here is I'm taking my pinky, I'm placing it on the 10th fret of the B string, All right, and I'm taking my 3rd fret, my 3rd finger, and placing it on the 9th fret of the G string, okay? And uh, so this is the 5th of the chord, and this is the, the root of the chord, so you got a 5 right here. All right, then I go to the 7th fret of the G string, I pick both the G string and the B string, and I hammer and pull off. I hammer on to the 8th fret, and then I keep my pinky here the whole time, basically, for this, and then my 3rd finger plays the 10th uh, fret on the... Uh, on the D string. And then I wind up with my first finger on the seventh fret of the D string, which is another root A. So I have an octave here. But the main part of this lesson is to learn that uh, this double stop right here. Because you can do you can do kind all kinds of riffs with this. It's not that hard, and it makes you sound cool. So, uh, first finger on the uh, seventh fret of the G string, pinky on the tenth fret of the B string, hammer pull off, and play the C note on the uh, tenth fret of the D string, and go back to the, uh, the G string, and there you have that octave. I'm going to uh, from an F9 to an E9, but that's not the lesson. This is the lesson. All right, this sounds cool with a, a kind of a minor feel to it because you have a C minor, right? I mean, uh, an A minor right here. But anyway, work on this part. Good exercise for beginners and intermediates uh, that are trying to, you know, up their game. Okay, guys, I'll talk to you later. Oh, if you like this, like the page. Bye.